Hey y'all, what's up? This is Rain Man, and this is going to be my video of the day, and this going to be pertaining about bullies. Um, I'm not talking about cyber bullies, I'm talking about bullies up forth, up close and personal, you know? Um, well, okay, in your opinion, what is a bully? My opinion, a bully is someone who attacks an individual or a small group um, physically or or slash and mentally while being unprovoked. Now, um, what, how can they do that? Well, physically, they punch, kick, throw stuff, do anything to touch you or anything like that. Mentally, that's one of the best things, their best tricks in the books is just to fuck with you mentally. They'll stereotype you, they'll call you names just by your looks or anything like that. Those are two ways a bully can attack you. Now, why do bullies bully? Well, it's kind of a hard answer, but every bully is different. You know, like, maybe they were abused as a child. Maybe they didn't get enough love or enough attention. Maybe they're doing it just to impress people. Um, they're doing it to make people laugh. They think, they think that shit's funny. Um, they're trying to get some attention. You know, that... A bully bullies people because of whatever ways have ever happened to them. And um, every bully is different. There's really no answer to that. You just have to ask the bully themselves. And um, let's see. Well, this will, this will be hard to believe, but yes. Well, actually, it's kind of easy. I have been bullied my whole life. Okay, after the second grade, before the second grade, I wasn't bullied. But after the second grade, I have been bullied. And, um, I'm going to be 100% real with y'all on everything. So, here it is. Fourth grade was the first time I was being bullied by this girl. Yes, it was a girl. She was big. She was fat. I'm pretty sure she was buff. And she kind of bullied me throughout the second, like, the, for a long time, she had, like, half, half of the year. Half the year of fourth grade. And in fifth grade, she only bullied me, like, two times. But... You know what? She was a girl. I couldn't punch her. I wanted to knock her bricks out. Um, I wanted to do anything, but I didn't. I couldn't. I was not physical back then. I was not a fighting person. I wasn't anything like that. And um, I couldn't hit a girl. I had too much respect for that. I don't have to worry about her today or tomorrow or next week. Why? Because that bitch is rotten in hell or heaven. I don't care. She's out of this world. And because two years ago she died in a drive-by. Do I feel any regrets? No. Why? Because that's what she gets. You know, I had felt no sympathy for her. And, um, let's see. Yeah, I just don't feel no sympathy for her. And Karma got her back. And, um, let's see. Uh, what else to say? Yes, I was bullied in fourth grade by a girl. Fifth grade, I wasn't bullied because I was kind of like the class clown type. So, for fifth grade, didn't do anything. Sixth grade, oh my gosh, sixth grade was kind of like a bully, bully not thing. It was another girl, but this one was like a emo rock girl. You know, like she was tall, skinny, and fucking emo. She was fast while she was chasing me. She took off my shirt, my belly showed out. And I'm all like, whoa, well, at least I know I have bigger tits than you, you know? Yeah, I got bullied by a girl. But then in seventh grade, through up, Oh boy, yeah, I was bullied a lot by bigger, tougher guys, but um, they, they, I was, in seventh grade, I was mostly attacked mentally, you know, it's eighth grade, mostly in eighth grade, yeah, eighth grade, it was mentally and physically, this dude, he, um, he was like five foot twelve, five foot, no, not five foot twelve, I think he was pretty much six foot. Um, his name was Dylan. He was also a juggalo. He had the Wraith tattoo right here on IC. I'm pretty sure he had ICP on his leg. I was like, dude, how are you going to fucking attack me? I mean, I'm a fucking... I mean, what the fuck, man? He's like, well, one, you just seem easy to fuck with. And two, I don't give a fuck. I was like, what the fuck? Okay, there was once he... We fought... He beat me up, but I didn't feel anything because he kept on punching me in my guts on my side. I didn't feel anything. I was like, oh, this ain't bad. This is pretty awesome. 
And then he just like, like the first punch he did, he punched me in my face right here. I had got like a red scar mark right here somewhere. And he started punching me on my sides and my guts. And it wasn't pretty bad. I was just laughing. And he was kind of like the worst bully ever. Like I ever had. Out of all the bullies, he'll be at number one. Tenth, I mean ninth grade. Yeah, I was Yu-Gi-Oh nerd. Of course I got bullied. And did I matter? Did it matter? No, because my brother was with me in high school and he protected me. He didn't pr protect me that long because I couldn't get into any other trouble. I would. I didn't want my problems to be my brother's problems. And then, tenth grade, not really. Eleventh grade, not really. Twelfth, senior year, I was not bullied. I was not bullied, but I hate to say it. I hate to be honest, but about this, but um. I actually bullied people whenever I was in the 12th grade. Um, I gave people wedgies, swirlies. I kind of like gave them wedgies and put them on the fence so they couldn't get down or their ass crack would hurt a lot. Now, why did I bully? I guess it was because I got, like, since I've been bullied so long, I actually got the traits. I bullied people just for LOLs, you know, just for laughing out loud. Just for fun. I don't know why, but I don't I don't bully people like that no more. I don't like do that no more. And you know, it's kinda sad just to actually hear that from me, you know, like I actually bullied people. Do I feel bad about it? Yeah, I feel bad about it. Why? Because it's kinda sad seeing someone that's being bullied turned into a bully. You know, that's a sad that's kinda like a sad thing to see or hear about. And, um, hmm. ways to prevent, and that's all, I mean, that's all my story, but ways to prevent a bully, you cannot prevent them, only but the only thing you prevent them by is not going to the place they are most likely to be at, you know, if you're going to stand up to a bully, don't stand up to a bully, that never ever works, if you stand up to a bully, they're just going to attack you, and um, if you're going to stand up to them, you better have more people than they do. And one thing you have to know about bullies, bullies hang in groups. You know, there's more, bullies will have friends. They'll have four or five, possibly ten. You better have twenty or or thirty. You better have a lot of fucking people behind your back because, I mean, bullies will be underestimated by the number amount of people that stand up to them. So a way to stop a bully is just for a bully to have their own medicine or one of the main things, talk to your parents, talk to a teacher, counselor, whatever. Talk to someone, you know. And if you're in high school, the t teacher kind of won't work. Um, counselor probably will work. Principal probably will work. If they're, attack if they're like attacking you, then you could probably do it. But then that's the adult school you know once you go to high school you're like an adult now you're kind of going to be an adult you're like young adults but um yeah uh don't ever walk away from a bully don't ever do that they say for you to walk away from a bully don't ever do that that will never work trust me i tried i got my mouth socked and yeah I think I was wearing braces because he hurt himself too. But yeah, this is my video on bullies. Um, comment, subscribe, like this if you like this. Dislike it if you dislike it. Um, yeah. Peace.